What is good, man? It's your boy Duff, and y'all notifies, man. We're back with another video today, man. I got a special video for y'all, boys, man. It's a playmaking sharpshooter, man. As you know, man, back from 2K19 when everybody had to play sharps. But um, before we jump into this video, man, I'm gonna need y'all to stop what y'all doing. Make sure y'all smash the like button, man. Let's aim for 30 likes on this video. I'm gonna give y'all a little second to do so. All right, y'all like the video up. I right, appreciate y'all, boys, for that. And um, if you're new, man, do not forget to hit that subscribe button. We're about like 90, 80 ish. No, eight, yeah, 87 to be exact. 87 subs away from 2,000, man. So if you ain't subbed up, man, go ahead and join the gang now. Make sure you sub up, man. Turn them noties on so you don't miss them daily streams, them daily lit streams with the sound requests. You, yeah, you know, all that good stuff, man. All that good stuff with your vibing. And, um, man just join the game man and if uh do not forget to leave some uh comments in the comment section for your boys so i can reply to all y'all boys comments and um man yeah let's go ahead and get straight into the video yo if you're hearing this man you're not caught lagging man make sure y'all hit that like button and hit that subscribe button all right today man i'm bringing y'all a playmaking sharpshooter man y'all know the vibes from 19 this is where everybody used the iso with on that game so you know this build man this be i know off rip man i don't bring y'all no bum iso builds man this, these iso builds go crazy now starting off with the position man you want to rock with the point guard whichever hand you want i finally got a low number this time <laughs> but you know i'm rocking with the one piece man for the skill breakdown, aka the pot chart, you want to rock with shooting and playmaking. That's the that's the green and the yellow pie chart, shooting and playmaking. All right, now for the physical profile, considering that this build will be 6'5", you want to go with the fastest physical profile. All right, now right here, y'all already know, man, y'all can skip through the video, do whatever y'all need to do, man, skim through it, or you can go along with me, feel free to choose. But just make sure you copy down exactly what I put here. Your close shot, you want to bring it up to an 85. Your driving layup, you want to bring up to a 77. Your driving dunk, you want to bring up to a 69. And you want to bring your standing dunk up to a 37. And that'll leave you with six finishing badges. For shooting, you want to bring your mid-range up to a 78. Max your three-point. Max your free throws. And that'll leave you with 16 green bean money machine things, man. 16 of them shooting things, man. Playmaking. You want to bring your bot, your pass accuracy up to an 88. And then you want to max your ball handling out at an 88. And then you want to bring your post moves up to a 47. And that'll leave you with 20 of them gold playmaking things, man. For defense, you want to max your interior defense. Max your perimeter. Max your lateral, max your steel, bring your block up to a 41, and then put the rest on your defensive rebound, and that'll leave you with nine of them red things, man. We're looking at six finishing, 16 shooting, 20 playmaking, and nine defensive badges, man. All right, now for the body shape, if you ain't rocking with the burly, man, make sure you rock with the burly. Because it gives you better bump animations in the game, which leads to more steals, better defense, dunks, etc. Man, I'm trying to put y'all on free game, so make sure you rock with that burly, man. For the height, we're going with 6'5". You take a hit on some things, but trust me, 6'5 is perfect, bro. You're still going to be fast. You still can speed boost. You're still going to be able to shoot. Don't, don't worry about all that, man. You're still going to be doing the, everything that you can do at 6'3", 6'4". But 6'5 is the perfect height for this build. For the weight, you want to drop the weight all the way down so you can get that 90 acceleration. For the wingspan, you want to leave it normal. Alright, now if we look at this build from a 99.9 .9 perspective. We're 6'5", 175, normal wingspan. So we do not have chicken little arms, T-Rex arms. We do not have that. So, you know, the defense is going to be nice on this build. But off rip, man, we're getting all the layer packages. Your dunk is at a 70 right now, but at 99.9, .9, it's going to jump up to a 75, so you will be dunking the ball. 
mid range the mid range is jumping to an 82 which is more than perfect because you know in this game bro you can have as low as like a 40 something shot and you're still green so 82 man 82 is by far enough and you have hall of fame shooting your three points at 89 and that 89 bro you're not missing bro the ball handling it is an 84 right now but you, you can dribble with it still trust me and plus after one little shot bro you can speed boost but your ball handling is going to show up to an 89 your interior defense, you know, we usually don't upgrade interior defense, but you know, we had some extra badge or attribute upgrades. So, you know, we had to get the interior up. The interior is going to jump up to a 60. The perimeter defense is going to jump up to a 78. Your lateral quickness is going to jump up to a 78. Them steelsies, man, them steelsies. Them steelsies jumping up to a 79. Your block is kind of low, but you put on the right badges, bro. You're still going to be um, swatting that thing, man. You still can get the snatch blocks, all that good stuff. But it's jumping up to a 52. And the defensive rebound. The defensive rebound is jumping up to an 81, bro. Even if you have rebound chase from bronze, bro, you're still gonna be horsing. Cause like you're 6'5, your rebounds up there, bro. You get proper position, bro. You're getting that board. That's not even the best thing about the build, bro. The best thing is the speed and acceleration on this build, bro. Although the speed does not get to a 99, it jumps up to a 96 with the gym rat plus the 99.9. Your acceleration jumps up to a 99 with the gym rat and 99.9. The strength, yes, yeah, low, but just to put it in there, the strength jumps up to a 57. And your vertical jumps up to a 79. Sheesh. Hey, this build, man. I ain't gonna lie, bro. This build, this build nice. I ain't even gonna lie to you. You gonna put that person on that island, man. You gonna shoot that thing. You gonna dunk that thing. <laughs> it's, it's unguardable, bro. All right, for the takeovers, man, we get four takeovers on this build we even get slashing on that build yeah that's crazy we don't even get the context we get slash and take two we get playmaking take sharp take shot creating take and slash and take all right you know to start off man i'm gonna definitely what i prefer on this build bro i definitely prefer playmaking because you know we're going for them clips off real but another reason why i prefer playmaking is because the build does not get 99 speed so with the playmaking take, you're definitely gonna boost up to 99 speed, 99 acceleration, all that good stuff. Bird jumping up, you know that good stuff. But um, I definitely recommend playmaking take on this build. But like I said, man, this is a preference thing. You can't rock with sharp. Sharp, you cannot go wrong with that. The sharp, you can shoot from deep. You know, sharp is a great takeover, bro. You can pick that. Should I create another great takeover, bro? You want to fade, you want to fade from the three, all that good stuff, man. Go ahead, choose that shot green take. Your um, close shot is up there on that build. So, you know, if you want to get toxic, bro, you can't take them close middies. But um, slashing, I feel like slashing is kind of the worst one in this situation because you not get contact dunks. And, uh, yeah, so we, yeah, we're not, we not going to rock with the slash. But, so, you know, man, we're rocking with the playmaking, so let's go ahead and put that playmaking on that boy. The name of it is a three-point playmaker, but this is AKA the playmaking sharp shooter from 2K19, man. Playmaking sharp shooter. So, you know, man, <laughs> I can't wait to use this build, bro, because this build definitely is a nice build. I ain't even gonna lie to y'all, boys. Let's go ahead and get this build to a 99, AKA a 95 overall. This will be your stats at 95 overall. Um, don't mind the 99. This is your stats at 95 overall. You just add plus five to all of these stuff. And for your physicals, you add plus four and then plus five, which totals to nine. So you add plus nine to all your physicals. All right, now finishing. We got six of them things. That's perfect. You can either set it up with all silver badges like this with contact fancy and um slithery because you know fancy and slithery and contact that's like a that's like the three musketeers like the three best fin finishing badges for ice on but you can rock with it with fancy and contact on gold but considering that we do not really have that high of a dunk we have a 75 dunk i'd probably just limit it to contact finish the silver fancy silver and slithery silver Shooting, you got 16 of them things, that's more than enough. Four Hall of Fame badges, that's quick draw, range extender, high zone, green machine. That's all you need. If you want to switch it up, man, feel free to. You can put it like this. Clutch shooter, even clutch shooter is an is a OP badge. I'm trying to tell y'all, any points after 15, a team gets 15, this badge activates, and you will not miss. 
but you know, it's really, really your preference. But for me, I probably rock with it just like this, sometimes even with plus shooter like that. 20 of them playmaker things was just perfect, unpluggable, quick first step, handles for days, diamond, fill out. These badges is essential, bro. You need these badges. Bell out is such a, a dominant badge, bro. Especially if you go up with something dumb, shoot something crazy by accident, you can easily bell out of it to your teammate. And most people don't expect it, so definitely a useful badge. None of them playmaking things. So if you're on the twos a lot, man, this would, this is definitely the badges I would run on twos right here. Clamps, Intimidator, and Pick Dodger. Perfect badges for twos, because that's all you need. But um, if I was playing threes and I wasn't guarding ball, I'd probably just switch it up to go interceptor. Because, you know, I'd be sitting in the corner, not really guarding ball, you know, that good stuff. But I like to play twos a lot, and I on the twos, so I'm going to run with Clamps, Intimidator, and Pick Dodger on goal. But there y'all boys have it, man. The playmaking sharpshooter from 2K19, man. This build is definitely a valid build, and I definitely recommend this build to anybody of the ISO community, man. You know, if it ain't ISO, man, it ain't right. But it's been your boy, Duffy, man. I appreciate all y'all boys. Make sure y'all smash the like button. Let's aim for 30 likes on the video. We got 87 more subs at 2K, man. We at 2K, there will be a giveaway on the channel. Do not forget about that. And um, make sure y'all leave some comments in the comment section. But like I said, man, it's been your boy, Duffy, and I'm out.